I love every type of music, and I know everyone says that, but I really do. Um, you can give me folk, you can give me country, you can give me rap. I've been buying a lot of old, like Frank Sinatra, Bing Crosby, Dean Martin, Ellie Fitzgerald, Billie Holiday albums, just because it mellows me out. And it's kind of cool when the ladies come over. They think I'm sophisticated, suave. It works out sometimes. <laughs> I grew up in the 90s, and I am a child of the 90s, and I love, I love me my grunge music. I love me my Kurt Cobain and his little outfit uh, Nirvana. Uh, I, like a good, I like a good Jane's Addiction. Uh, I like a good Pearl Jam. I love all this stuff. Uh, rock and roll, you know, um, 80s metal, stuff like that. And, uh, this is hard for me to admit, but my mom loved Madonna and Dr. Hook and uh, Air Supply. My all-time favorite band is Red Eye Chili Peppers. And they're just having fun and it's funky and it's cool and it's, you know, coming out with these songs that you can, you know, throw on the radio and then right after that there's no song you can completely just go crazy to. Right now I'm really in like the punk phase kind of like with Sum 41 and I've got Linkin Park on my iPod and Fall Out Boy and um, Rihanna's new album. My stepdad made me a Billy Joel tape, that's the Billy Joel, and I got obsessed with Billy Joel. And then I started, and then my dad got me um, Guns N' Roses, Appetite for Destruction, and that's, that opened up a whole new door of rock to me. Bands I listened to growing up, well the first album I ever owned was Metallica, the Black Album. And that was, that's amazing, that's, that was my first journey into music. I like songs that have really good lyrics and the person that's singing them is really having feeling in the song. But I love music, every type of music from all walks of earth.